Ladies and gentlemen, everything in between, hello, welcome to the channel. So, today we've got a video by Henry Moody. It's called A Day in the Life of British Secondary School. And I did a video right before this one of like a British school, but all it, legitimately, all it was was the girls were hanging out in the bathroom, literally, there was a whole congregation in the bathroom. They were eating outside and the guys were playing soccer, football. And then we were at lunch again. <laughs> there was actually no like substance of school in the vlog. So I was like, wait a minute, what's going on there? So now I found a video, I guess about British secondary school from a guy's perspective. Maybe that was just a girl's perspective, but I wanna see how it compares with the guys. Are the guys just hanging out and goofing around like the girls were? Do they have school buses? Like what's going on? Let's get into it, let's see. Subscribe if you're new, like the video, do me a video request over on Instagram, and here we go into British secondary school. Oh, hey Google, shut up. <laughs> hey Google, shut up. So what time is he waking up though? I kinda don't wanna get up, but I probably should because it's the last day of school. Okay, first thing I noticed was the room. Buddy has like a headboard that looks like it's at least it looks a little bigger than a twin bed, so hmm, I was gonna say the room is actually big in comparison to what is said about like um, the UK or London apartments, but homie only has like enough side room for a bedside table, so maybe it's not as big as I thought. Hmm. I kinda don't wanna get up, but I probably should because it's the last day of school. Oh well. Get your ass up. Get up! I'm up. As they say, the early bird catches the worm. <laughs> if my Alexa, Alexa, never mind. I have to be careful saying her name because she always wants something. Anyways, if she were to start talking to me in a British accent at seven in the morning, talking about early bird gets the worm, I would unplug her. bathroom does look a little small though but because you can see the shower is like really right next to the sink but I like the tile and everything and like the modernness of it it's very nice <laughs> it's a big bathroom actually this is what I was afraid of when I said the with school uniforms there's no self-expression literally how do you even learn to style yourself if you're wearing a uniform? How do you learn to dress? How do you know what style you like? How to express yourself, like I've been saying. Homie's entire closet is like Spongebob. The same shit, every, literally everything's the same. Literally. You've got like 10 of the same white polos, a couple jackets to go over it, a few sweaters. I couldn't do a school uniform. Mm -mm. All black and white. Send help. What was that? Alpine? Like Raisin Bran, basically. Country crisps. British cereal, interesting. If you've had American cereal, how would you, I would assume that ours is more sugary, but what do you prefer more, British cereal or American cereal, and how do they compare to you if you've tried them? So okay, so not only was the girl in the last video walking to school, but this guy is too. So I think it's fair to assume there's no school buses in, in the UK. That's unfortunate though, because if it's raining, if it's snowing, like if your parents aren't able to drop you off, if you're disabled and can't walk to school, how do you get to school? There should be like a, in America there's an operating system, like we have all these, say there's like five school buses. They, they divide out the city to where there's different routes for all those school buses to pick up all the children or students or whatever and get them to school. That's something y'all could do. You need to do. You probably weren't doing that. What the hell are you doing right now? And honestly, I have no idea. I felt like I needed to do something that was a bit more like into my personal life and stuff, so. And ne what is ne Alexa, what is negative seven degrees Celsius to Fahrenheit? I'm staying home. I would stay home. 
Now, I went to school in Erie, Pennsylvania. If you don't know where that is, it's literally the, as north as you can go in the United States. And when I tell you it was the, they said it was the year with the highest snowfall, literally trudging to class with snow up to my knees, literally. But that was only maybe a few weeks out of the year. Y'all are doing this every single day. I'd be homeschooled. What's the point? I'm not gonna kill myself to go to public school. Get me a school bus. I decided to do like vlogging school and you know, see what happens and hope this doesn't get taken down by the school and stuff because I'm not gonna lie, it probably will. How can your school take down your personal vlog? It's not in their jurisdiction. I guess actually because you are filming on a private property, but I feel like over here there would be some like freedom of expression, freedom of speech, um, media, blah, blah, blah. There's some correspondence to allow for you to do what you want to do. She's pretty. I can't, I sound like a man. What? They were on a school bus. My bad, I was tripping. Okay, he walked to the school bus, it seems, not to actual school. I can't, I sound like a man. Look at the bus, they got the handles, the LED lights. Okay, I like this guy because he's actually showing like the actual school part of it. The last one was literally just a hangout session, but he's showing like the different um, maths, sciences, all that kind of stuff. You get to see the layout of the schools. It's kind of like a lecture hall more than just like single desks. You have them in rows. I like that. You got the projector or the Promethean board. Also the chalkboard and all that. Very interesting. I like that. It kind of makes me think back to educating Yorkshire. Ah, uh, Kahoot. We all love Kahoot. But yeah, I'm thinking back to educating Yorkshire and how just unruly and crazy those children were. These ones seem like they're eloquent. <laughs> Oh, did you see the hair? What's going on, buddy? If he likes it, though, I guess. Uh, we need to actually think of injuries to play because I can't do both of Gym class? I'm kind of confused what's all going on. So he's showing us his school day. So he had science class and they played Kahoot, it seems. And I guess this is him transitioning to his next class. But why was he outside? Why were they outside? I don't know. And the last one we saw them have recess, so maybe they're having a recess again. And if you don't know what recess is, is that basically just means like playtime. Literally just like a period of time. Like how you have lunch to eat, you have recess to hang out and play. And then we're at gym class, I guess. Or athletics. But if in high school, he looks like he would be in high school. It's like you don't have to take athletics anymore if you don't want to. Like it's a designated thing to play for the school. It's not just like to keep the students fit anymore. So if he doesn't like it, why do you sign up? I'm not sure. Is it mandatory? Let me know. Salmonella muffin. Interesting. I guess he's at lunch then. And then we're watching, I don't remember what movie, it's some Christmas thing. <laughs> I would love to try little British snacks. I don't have a P.O. box though. But look at the drip, look at the shoes. Are they comfortable? Leather, black shoes? Mm. Guys, this is the best day of my life. We're watching out now, so. Anyways, they're watching a lot of movies because I guess it's Christmas time, so. Ooh, Cadbury's! Merry Christmas, everyone. More Kahoot. And really, did I make it? Okay. They're, they're all playing around! I think it's because it is Christmas, so like the teachers are obviously not as strict, but yeah. So what have I learned? The school, c comparing just based off of the two Christmas or the two school videos we've seen today, British schools aren't as like serious, I guess, um, which is also why y'all are disciplined the way you are. 
like whenever we did the educating Yorkshire videos, I was always like the teacher would never yell at us. They would never raise our voice or their voice or anything like that. And it's because they would never have a reason to. Just based off these two vlogs, I can see it's like a little less, it's a little more loose, I guess, in the behavior. But yeah, and I still stand on my stance about school uniforms. I would not want to wear them. I know like for the kids who can't possibly afford the newer clothes like Adidas or Nike or whatever, but at the same time, over here, there were kids who couldn't afford the name brand clothes, but nobody cared because it doesn't matter. Okay, I wear Gucci Gucci to school and you're out here wearing Fruit of the Loom. Bitch, as long as you're clothes and I can't see your goodies, that's all that matters. But yeah, I wouldn't want to wear school uniforms. If you did, let me know if you liked it. Comment down below. Like the video. Subscribe to me here. See you in the next one. Bye.